Good day, ladies and gentlemen. My name is Fabi, and welcome to Arrows DIY. On my channel, I like to do Dollar Tree DIYs, high-end dupes, thrift flips, and the occasional trash of treasure. Today is day six of the 10 days of shabby chic live crafting extravaganza. And today I have two of my crafter friends. The first is Michelle from Moxie DIY in Java. And the second is Ellie from DIY from House to Home. So be sure to check them their channels out. Their channels are in my description box below. Show them all the YouTube love you have to offer. And I'm going to say thank you in advance because you're going to love it. They're awesome channels. All right. So let me bring them in so that we can welcome them and start the crafting. Hello. Hello. <laughs> Hello, everyone in the chat. So let's see. Um... I'm hearing an echo. I hope our volumes are down. Okay, so here we have Liz from, oh yeah, we have Liz, we have Robin here. Hello, thank you so much for stopping by. We got Denise. Hi Denise, thank you so much for coming back. We got Moxie in the chat, Moxie on the screen. Moxie's everywhere. So she's, <laughs> she's, she's, she's the one in the center right here, right here. That's her. Oh wait, oh wait. <laughs> right? It's like, wait, no. I still don't have it. Day six, I still don't know. Hey, <laughs> Who else is here? Let's see. Uh, Maria's here. Hello, Maria. I will not forget the number today. I promise I will reveal the number. <laughs> okay. And let's see. We have Robin's Buys and DIYs. Oh, a happy hoarder. I almost missed you. That's Jerry. Hi, guys. Thank you so much for stopping by. Um, is that everyone? If I miss someone, I am so sorry, but we need to get to crafting because it's only one hour and it's not enough time. Now, <laughs> for the giveaway, hi Mary, I see you. Thank you for coming. So for the giveaway today, I'm going to give away this um, home decor folk art crackle. Don't judge my label. It's good stuff. Um, you can't really see it, but it's crackle and it's the medium crackle. So this is what I'm going to be using today, hopefully in my DIY. And you're supposed to use this with chalk paint. So um, this gives a really cool finish. Um, I used it in a video previously. I'll link that in the description box below. But um, yeah, Crackle, there's a lot of potential with this. So what was I going to say? Oh yeah, Moxie, what are you working on today? So I kind of have a decoupage egg <laughs> smorgasbord. <laughs> um, so I am using the... Um, the six pack of, where's my thing? There we go. The six pack of eggs from the Dollar Tree. Uh, these ones were the gold ones, but you can use any color that you want. I actually spray painted them white until my spray paint can died. But I, um, I did that and then I am Mod Podging good old wait, plaid products. There we go. <laughs> oh, I love that Mod Podge. <laughs> Mod Podge. And then I'm going to be used this gift tissue that was out at the DT last year. Hopefully they'll bring it back. Oh, it's a little blurry, but I oh. know what you mean. I got it. I got it. Yeah. The pretty leaves. Go. And then um, I have all sorts of different um, accessories. So stickers, rub-on transfers. So shabby. Lace. So we'll figure it out. Yes. I love it. It looks great. And how about you, Ellie? What are you going to be working on today? We are going to make a garland, a shabby chic garland using these are from the, oh, where's the camera? The Dollar Tree. Mm -hmm. <laughs> this pack here. And then I have some pretty uh, scrapbook paper. So I think I'm going to use this on top and we're just going to see how it goes. <laughs> Fantastic. So I like that idea. Let me write down um, the number before I forget. And of course, <laughs> there's no pen around, but we're going to use whatever. All right. So... I need to pick a number between what and what. Michelle can pick the starting number. Ellie can pick the ending number. Okay. Um, 75. Ooh. That's the starting number? Yeah, I guess. <laughs> Whoa. Um, We're going big. Um, pay attention, Fabi. Pay attention. I got to pay attention. Uh, 132. 132. <laughs> you heard it here, <laughs> ladies and gentlemen. The number's between 75 and 132. So I will pick a number and write it on this um <laughs> All right, what number am I picking? Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Oh, yesterday's winner. Right, let me just say, yesterday's winner, there was a tie yesterday. Two people picked oh. the same number. So I'm gonna contact both of the winners. Congratulations to Denise and to Lola. 
So both of you guys, congratulations. But I will reach out to you and we'll figure something out because we, we're not fighting over crafting. Okay. <laughs> so I'm going to go ahead and write the number and put it up here. And we need to get to crafting. So I have two options today. I can either do this um, egg. It's like, you know, those plastic eggs from the Dollar Tree, the plastic ones, the little ones. Or I could use this. I might use this one. This is a soap dish from the Dollar Tree, but I'm going to turn it into like a little egg shadow box kind of oh, thing. Cute. Cute. So it might be kind of cool if you guys find one of these in your Dollar Tree. They can be eggs. Let's see. <laughs> Let's see. All right, guys. So you want to go ahead and guess the numbers. Now would be a good time. And now we have, oh, I see numbers. Never mind. Um, hi, Doug. Welcome. Thank you so much for stopping by. Mary says she's never tried Crackle Medium before. You should take actually. Have you guys tried Crackle Medium? I, I have not. It's fun. It's fun, fun stuff. stuff. I saw you use it before, but I've never done it myself. Yes, I, I love this stuff. So I'm going to see if I can, um, I'm going to paint something and show you how quickly the crack happens. It's really cool. And let's see. Thanks. Thanks, guys. All right. A soap dish. Yes. Yes, Mary, a soap dish. Are you, are you surprised? You should not be surprised. Who knows? <laughs> I, okay. I mean, if she can make nine ladies dancing out of cowboys and... Native Americans. What can't Fabby do? <laughs> Thanks, guys. Thanks. <laughs> so let me get, of course, I forgot the sign. Oh, my goodness. I'll be right back. I'm going to get the sign. Uh oh. <laughs> oh, that's so pretty, Michelle. I love that. <laughs> Gee, thanks. <laughs> got my little cutout here, ready to go on my egg. Oh, I like that. Is that lace on the side? This is, I don't know. It's almost like um, kind of like pattern print on the That's scrap pretty. paper. I like that. We're going to go in with some Mod Podge. I think all of us are doing Mod Podge today. <laughs> Probably. I, we? I think we're all doing plaid products today. That's true. I think so. All right, so I found a sign. I got this one on clearance um, on Michael's. It was in the grab bag. Oh, cute. So I'm just going to use this little one. And I'm going to start off by painting it white. Unless the chat thinks of a nice color that I can use, then I'll use that. All right. But for now, I'm just going white. Where's my chalk paint? There you are, my love. Let us get started. Okay. How are you guys about your paintbrushes? Are you guys good with paintbrushes? Mm, um, not so much. I rinse them. <laughs> <laughs> That's about it. Do you stick them in a jar and forget? I like do. I I've thrown many, <laughs> many paintbrushes away. <laughs> like hard as rocks. Oh my goodness. <laughs> yes, that happens to me all the time. Sad to say. All right, so I'm just gonna start painting. Uh oh, there's more people. Why did I just guess a number? <laughs> uh, we're just doing a giveaway. Uh, today is a giveaway for this product. It's called um, Crackle Medium. If you've never tried it, it makes a really cool effect on your furniture or whatever project you're working on. So this is what we're giving away today. Every day is a little prize. So. This is what I'm going to be using on my project today, and this is what is up for grabs. You just have to guess a number between 75 and 132. So, <laughs> 75 and 132. Thanks, Moxie. <laughs> I'm here to help. Welcome, Rhonda. It's first time watching. I love crafting too. Sweet. We all love crafting in this community. Let's see. So many new people. I'm so happy. Nice to see you. Looks like Robin's the same with uh, paint brushes. <laughs> Just kidding, Robin. All right, let's see. 
Robin's like, no, no. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm just painting in the air because this is my setup right now. Has anyone in the chat lost track of before? I am so curious. Looking good, Moxie. That's looking good. <laughs> Thank you. I love that paper that you have, Ellie. Where did you find that? I think I actually got this from um, Panda Hall. Oh, okay. I think. Or BB Craft. Nice. Yeah, one of, one of the two. <laughs> it's really pretty. In a little foot. I love it. I love it. <laughs> Someone said, hello, Robin. My daughter is also named Robin. <laughs> Let me know if the sanding is annoying and I can mute. <laughs> <laughs> so when you use crackle medium, you the first layer you want to put on is chalk paint. And then once that's dry completely, you'll put on the crackle medium, this stuff, you'll put this on a nice, um, I don't want to say a thick layer, but you have to try to make it as even as possible. So Generally. not, a, not a lot of paint, paint strokes, if that makes any sense. Hmm. So you want to put it on as e evenly and as, as quickly as possible. And um, then once that's on, you let that dry and then you put on your paint on top and then it crackles on its own and it happens really quickly and it's really cool to watch let's see let's see is it i n or y n what is she oh robin okay never mind okay with my sister oh, karina you could definitely guess again no worries blame moxie blame moxie <laughs> no, 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 no. <laughs> I like I like the the variation in number. Do, 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 do. Do, 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 do. Does anybody want um to guess a number? I mean a number here, a color. Guys, it's late, sorry. Um a color, maybe pink or blue or green. Could somebody give me an, a, a color? Because I need to have a color under and I need to have a color on top hmm. so that the crackle effect um, is obvious. The colors can't be too close. Um, yeah, they can't be too similar. So maybe a darker color underneath? Yeah, so what, what color do you think I should do? I was thinking maybe gold. Ooh, but that it's not a, really cool. But it's not a chalk paint. Oh, does the chalk paint have to be on the bottom? Um, it's supposed to be, chalk, according to the label, it's supposed to be chalk paint on the bottom and like beneath and then chalk paint on top. Oh. However, when I did my DIY, I used the wrong paint because my paint bottles look exactly the same. So look. <laughs> oh. They look exactly the same. So I picked the wrong, instead of grabbing this one, I grabbed this one. And it still worked. It's just... You know, you want to do it according to the label. I'd so, say try the gold. That would look really cool. Yeah, maybe I could. Yeah, that was that was my point. So what I'm saying is it might work with an acrylic paint. Yeah. Since it did the first time. Gold and pink would look pretty. That's kind of like the color scheme, I think, this year, isn't it? Is, is it? Like gold and pink. <laughs> like Wait a minute. Where are you looking that I'm not looking? <laughs> <laughs> the rabbit hole. <laughs> Oh man, <laughs> I missed the memo. Me yeah, too. like like greens, um, pinks, and I think aquas are kind of like the color of the season or something. At least that's what I saw down the rabbit hole of Pinterest. <laughs> Interesting. I should have. Oh my goodness, I can't go on Pinterest too much. I get I get sucked in for hours. Does that happen to you when you go on Pinterest? all the time <laughs> i get sucked into the void of pinterest all right so i'm gonna let this dry now 
kind of don't want to paint the outer edge of the frame yet because I want to be able to hold it. <laughs> so I might do that late, like after the live. Paint oh, yeah. Just so I can hold it. <laughs> These eggs are slippery. <laughs> <laughs> I keep flinging them at myself. <laughs> so why are you sanding them? So they have little wrinkles. Let's see if it'll pick it up. From the... Um, uh, tissue paper you can kind of see it like there's a big oh. one right there so I'm just sanding off those wrinkles just to like soften them a bit it's not going to get rid of them completely without taking the paper off completely so I'm just softening them a little bit oh okay awesome okay so Rhonda is saying turquoise and pink hmm turquoise I kind of like that turquoise and pink hmm Oh my goodness, now I have to think. Okay, let me see. Where do the Pinterest people get their ideas from? The Pinterest people. <laughs> True. Hi, Connie. Welcome. Thanks so much for stopping by. Um, the Pinterest people. It's like the pod people. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Goodness, this has to be painted in under an hour. Let's I know. Go. I'm like, oh, focus. Focus, focus. I have to get this done. Yeah. So if you guys didn't know before you make a video, it takes how long does it take you guys to record the video? Like from start to finish? Yeah, let's say yeah. Oh, like four days. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> exactly. I'm like, oh my goodness. How about you, Ellie? How long does it take you? Typical, um, on average. Um, if I'm like really, really focused, I mean, I could get done in one day, but usually two days if I plan accordingly. <laughs> yeah. If everything, if the if, if everything works out, right? Yes. If nothing comes <laughs> up, and I have like an easy dinner scheduled for the week, <laughs> like a <frozen> nice <laughs> <laughs> pasta night, pasta. Yeah. Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> See. I'm trying to get in that corner. I should have I should have took off that paper. I don't know what I was thinking. I wasn't. Okay. But it's fine. It's kind of like bubbling up because the paper was there. That's never happened to me before. But this is live crafting. Anything can happen. Indeed. I'm going to work with it. I'm going to work with it. Okay. So while that dries... I'm going to I'm going to work on this egg. Oh, thanks, Connie. Yeah, I love keys for keys too. <laughs> oh yeah, that's <laughs> pretty. Uh, Mary, yes, they are stickers. Um, I got them from the Dollar Tree. Um, these ones, I'll turn them around. Kind of like brooches, I guess. Or pendant. I, I really like those. I've never seen those before. I really like those. Yeah, those are. Oh nice. my goodness! You're killing me, Moxie. I love it. <laughs> so love I'm it. really, I'm really lucky because I have four Dollar Trees near me, and two of them are really good. Oh. So I'm <gasps> really fortunate. I, I, I count my blessings on that part. <laughs> I'm so happy for you. I'm so happy for you. Congratulations. On your Dollar Tree. <laughs> I hit the Dollar Tree jackpot. Yes. Oh, my goodness. So again, like this. Yes, this is the way. Okay. This is the way. So, hmm. Should I do a rub-on transfer? I don't know. Let's see. What am I feeling like today? I made this yesterday, if you guys missed it. I made this Ew. little, um, it's like a shabby chic um, egg. I made that on yesterday's live. That's pretty. Thanks. And let's see. What should I use? I don't know. I guys, I'm I don't plan my DIYs because I kind of go with the flow. What do I feel? What which one is calling my name? <laughs> Cuz if I plan, I never do. I never do what I want wanted to do. Is what I'm saying. Yeah. So let me see. I have some of this scrapbooking paper. I kind of want to use this because it's really pretty. Oh, that's really pretty. 
and I don't want it to go to waste and it's kind of gold. But then again, aren't we doing gold and how oh, are we doing turquoise? Guys, any help? Turquoise and pink? Oh, yeah. Turquoise would be look really pretty. Turquoise and pink. Yeah, I think I might do that. Turquoise and pink. Okay. So I'm just going to rip it just to give it like a raw edge, like a weird, you know, like a random, a randomness to it. Like and then I'm just going to put it inside of here somehow. I don't want it to be perfect. Then I'm thinking about putting, nestling some, um, some flowers in there and maybe some pearls and accents like that. Oh, that'd be pretty. I think so. Thanks. That's what I'm thinking. I can do it in one day. Connie, what can't you do? <laughs> you can do it all. This lady lays her floor down. She <laughs> makes DIYs. She crochet. No, she knits. She knit me a hat. Thank you, Connie. Aww. My hair is sweet. This, this lady is multi-talented. I don't get it. I mean, leave room for someone else, Connie. <laughs> Michelle, I love those keys. Oh, yeah. Thank you. It looks so good. Oh, my goodness. I love it. It reminds me of, like, royalty. I love it. Yes. Pink and gold. Gold and pink is good, too. Yeah, I know. I do gold and pink. Yellow and pink. Hmm. Purple and pink. Uh, what am I going to do? I love color. Guys, I love using color. Oh, okay. me too. I think we all love using color. Yes. <laughs> Let's see. Purple and yellow. Uh, I just used purple and yellow in my last video. I might go for something else. Let's see. Purple and pink. Hmm. Purple and yellow. Gold purple and, and yellow would be pretty. Purple and yellow. Let's see. Thank you. Connie says, thank you. I believe purple is the color of royalty. Oh, yeah. I think you're right. Yes, I did hear that somewhere. Let's see. Hmm. Purple. Why? This is a really hard decision, guys. <laughs> you can do it. <laughs> now I'm thinking, what if I ombre it so that I can use both colors and then Ooh, have a cool. Like having gold and then like purple and then crack it and then have pink on top. I think that would look really cool. Okay, cool. All right. So is that dry yet? No, the paint is not dry yet. Okay. I'm just gonna go ahead and decoupage some. Let me see. I'm losing my eggs. <laughs> no no. <laughs> Popping out of my hands. <laughs> Let's see, where is it? Ooh, rose gold and blue. That's pretty. Ooh, this color's nice too. I just ran into this one. It's called <laughs> Ran Into. Yes, my craft space. Yes, I just ran into this. It's Italian sage. It's like a light Ooh. green. Oh, <gasps> that's pretty. Now I kind of want to use this one. Oh my goodness, this is too many, too many decisions. <laughs> Guys, I'm so sorry. I'm sorry. I can't make a choice. Do rose gold and Caspian blue. Caspian. It's like a deep blue, Karina. It's it's a deep blue. Kind of like, I want to say cobalt blue, but that's not going to help. It's almost um, like ocean. Like ocean blue. Yeah, it's a very bold blue. It's pretty. Like, wow. I'm drawing a blank. Hmm. Like flag blue, like the American flag blue. Kind of, but like a bold. I don't know, guys. I tried. I tried. <laughs> Where is my all right? Decoupage some. I'm gonna go ahead and paint on some. I need a brush. So here's brush. how my little eggs are coming out. Oh, they're so pretty. And I have four. So now I'm going to distress the sides just a little bit. 
Oh, that's so pretty. I like how those flowers go with it. Love My favorite thing. egg is that one there, closest to you. I love that one. Yeah, I like that one too. I love that one. So good. Let's see. Hello, ladies. I'm excited to see what you're crafting. Oh, thanks so much for stopping by today. Welcome. Thank you. Oh, here we got Moxie. Moxie, those little eggs are pretty, says Maria. Aww. Thank you. So pretty, Ellie, says Connie. Hello, Cezanne. Welcome. Thanks so much for stopping by today. Oh, the giveaway today is this crackle medium. Um, if you guys want to go ahead and guess that in the chat since you're here, thank you so much. Um, you guys can win this, and it's super cool. And I'm going to show you how it works, hopefully, once it's paint dries. But this is amazing stuff. And um, you just got to guess a number between 75 <laughs> and 132, I believe. Where did that paper go? Oh, we had to make it uh, really specific and hard on you guys. <laughs> yeah. Well, you got to make sure you're paying attention, you know? <laughs> you got to make sure. Have the sound up. <laughs> yes. So now I'm just going to decoupage some of this paper on here. And I want it to be very random. Is this a side? No, nope, this is the wrong side. Okay, never mind. We're going to do it on this side. Goodness gracious. Get it together, woman. All right. I'm going to rip this little scrapbook paper. It's like a gold one. And little, little um, pieces. Oh, I sound like I'm in a tunnel. I'm so sorry. Hi, Tammy. Welcome. I don't know how to fix that, Connie. I'm not tech savvy. <laughs> I'm only crafty. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. How much have you gotten done, Fatty? Hmm. So far? I have this drawing, and I'm about to decoupage some paper onto here. And it's amazing sometimes. I actually finish on time. <laughs> so I'm going to do like that. You see how I'm decoupaging it on there? Ooh. Oh, that would be pretty. If you guys have never used Mod Podge, I have no idea. I can't assume who's watching. So Mod Podge dries clear. So you see it like that now? but it won't be there later. Nice. That's so I'm using that as well as this polka dot paper that I used yesterday. Oh, here it goes. Yep, that just happened. This one. I'm just going to rip this rip this paper up because it's like polka dot. It's so cute. How much am I going to end up? I'm anxious to see... No pressure. No pressure. Okay. I'm just going to rip this into like random little pieces to randomly decoupage it on. I love my patch. Yes, me too. Yes, me too. How am I going to do this? Okay. Oh, we only have 30 minutes left. I know. I'm telling you, oh, an hour is not enough. Yeah. <laughs> but it will, it will work. <laughs> it will work out. Everything will be fine. I only have two arms. <laughs> <laughs> I'm about to pull out my, my heat gun because it's going to happen today. All right. Let's see. My podge. No pressure. <laughs> yeah. She's so funny. And I also want to put lace. I want to put a whole bunch of stuff. Oh, that's oh my gosh. I almost knocked over my water. <gasps> you almost did? I almost knocked over my, uh, my paintbrush water. <laughs> oh, my, oh my goodness. I'm freaking out. <laughs> that's when it happens in slow motion. No. I know. <laughs> Not the water. Okay. I'm just randomly putting it around like so. Hmm. Yeah, I gotta do the whole egg. I was gonna do half the egg, but I feel like maybe I should have to do the whole egg. So you know it's an egg from far away. You know what I mean? Oh yeah. You might not be able to tell. 
Um, where is my oh there it goes. So how was your day, ladies? What kind of day did you have today? Very busy. It was good. <laughs> That's good. I went to the park with the kids today. Ooh. Was the sun out? Yes. It was out and it was great. Except nice. you know. When you have little, little babies and they want to go to the park, it means that you're going to be doing all the heavy lifting. Exactly. <laughs> so I got to work out, is what I'm saying. I got to work out today. All right. I'm going to go ahead and just randomly put it on. That's always nice. Our son has been out for the last couple days, and that's been nice. But it's going to start raining this weekend. I know. There's like a, apparently a crazy storm coming. Yeah. Oh, no. Yeah, it's gonna hit lots of places, I think. Oh, no. Just now. So I hope everyone stays safe out there. I hope it passes by really quickly and does no damage to anyone. All right. So I'm just gonna put this right here. I missed the beginning. Is the theme tonight eggs? Yes, the theme is eggs. <laughs> <laughs> no. <laughs> no. <laughs> this is how my little decoupage project is coming so far. It's coming along. Ooh, and I'm gonna add um I'm gonna add flowers. Thank you. I'm gonna add flowers and a whole bunch of embellishments. So I'm just gonna keep adding on. Keep adding on. But Moxie, I'm so jealous of your jewels. <laughs> <laughs> I'm bringing the blink night. Time for a lemonade break. I see the chic. Where's the shabby? Oh, how dare you, sir? It's not. <laughs> yes, the theme is A. All right. So if you guys haven't guessed the number yet, go ahead and guess the number in the dis I mean in the chat. I almost said description box below. Too many voiceovers. I do that all the time. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> leave it in the comment box. Leave it in the description box below. All right. <laughs> Here, this is the giveaway today. It's a crackle medium by Folk Art, a plaid product. It's um, John, it might be great for you. You like to work with wood, and it does crackle. Oh, wait, but you don't paint wood. But this is a this is not paint, it might it might be okay for you. There you go. You got to pick a number between 75 and 132. Wow, to, to win the crackle. <laughs> Snap, I dropped my egg. Okay. Let's see. The theme is egg. We're traveling in an RV. Oh man, stay safe. I hope it. I hope it doesn't go there. Let's see. Denise, uh, it worked. Why would I paint wood exactly? Oh he my God. <laughs> he's a he's a woodworker. He does like scrolling and stuff on his channel. If you guys don't know about John, uh, John C. What if I could? That's his channel link right there. You guys could check him out. He does great work. I mean, his personality is, uh, but <laughs> his work is great. <laughs> I'm joking, John. I'm joking. <laughs> no, your work really is great. So I'm going to go ahead and put that. Okay. So this is how it's coming along. Coming along. Oh, but John did paint wood. Okay. So now, I don't know what to say. Apparently, you're welcome. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. All right. All right. Where are we at? What time? We're at 35. We can do it. Okay. So now I'm thinking I'm going to add this to work. From the Dollar Tree. If I can get it out of this tangled mess, one second. There it goes. Holly rope. This is available in the hardware oh. section. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I've seen that. Oh. So I'm gonna just outline the um. I'm gonna outline the egg. All right. <laughs> Okay, so we got chalk paint. Cover the chalk paint. 
if, if you leave your chalk paint uncovered for too long, it becomes like solid. I don't understand. So I try to cover it right away when I'm working. Like literally, like 10 minutes, it's already thicker than it was before you. Anyways, I don't know. Do you guys think that or is it just me? <laughs> yeah, that and Mod Podge, I feel like they dry like super quickly if you leave them un uncovered. Right. And I wish the lid on top was better. Like, I don't like that. Yes. It's, it's like, you know, this and then it's at the top of it. And I'm like, oh. Yeah. And, and the paper thing on top always comes off. It never fails. And it fails. gets stuck to it or it gets in <laughs> Yes. And, and then your hands get messy and now you have to go wash your hands before you can craft for your video. It's like a whole thing. Uh, especially the antiquing wax because your hands look like dungeon hands after. <laughs> and you're like, no one wants to see this. I have to wash my hands. And it doesn't come off either. <laughs> what is going on? I do not work in the mine. Okay, <laughs> let's cut this off. Uh, where's my scissors? My toddler has been in my craft space, so that's why I can't even find my scissors. Okay, there they go. I don't know. Yeah, I think, I don't know. He's just a crafty one, I guess. Oh my goodness. I'm going to tell you something personal, you know, not that you care, but my son put, like, he cut his hair. Oh no. Aww. And he just got a haircut, so I don't know what to do. He has like a stripe right here. <laughs> and I don't know what to do. It's like in the middle of his head. So we went to the park today and he was like, he had a hat and a hood. <laughs> and he was like, Mom, I can't forget to take, I can't forget to cover it. I'm like, oh, goodness. Anyways, just a fun fact in case you guys are interested. Well, it'll be a life lesson, I guess. Fun <laughs> fact with Daddy. Oh my gosh, I don't know what to do. I don't know oh. what to do. He's that Everybody. child. Out of all of them, I have to have like five eyes on him. <laughs> Seven minutes. Seven mm. minutes unsupervised. Let's see. Uh, Karina, I will be live on Sunday. Ooh, John will be live on Sunday. And so will I. What time will you be live, John? <laughs> what time will you be live, John? But his lives are not like these lives. His lives are full of a whole bunch of woodworkers and it's really fun. Let's see. Because they so, know, you know, they know their stuff. You learn a lot. Let's see. So Robin, I'm not making a crown. I'm just making like a, um, I don't know, what are those called? Like where you just kind of like loop over the ends, uh, support ribbon, I think. What are they called? Oh, like the awareness. Yeah. Yes. Awareness ribbons. And then I'm just going to glue it on there. So it'll look like that. Those are going to be the cutest eggs. <laughs> I love that. And if I try it, I will give you credit, Moxie. <laughs> so Karina's saying they should make them so they squirt out kind of like a ketchup bottle. That yes. Would be nice. I agree. That would be awesome. Something better than what they have right now. Definitely. Yeah. It's a hurt on the way home. Oh, she's so sweet. Let's see what time, John. All day? He's going to be live all day. I doubt that. You know, <laughs> you know, John went live for 24 hours. Oh, wow. wow. I think he hit, what was the milestone he hit? I think it was like 250 subscribers. Wow. And he goes, Savvy, Robin, if you guys can get me to 250 subscribers, we'll go live. I'll go live for 24 hours. And he did. How does, how does someone do that? I don't even and know how to made, go live for 24 hours. He, he made 24 projects. Wow. And I still have yet to see mine. <clears throat> <laughs> just, just saying. So this is where we're at. I put the poly rope around. Now I'm going to add flowers and a whole bunch of stuff. I might add jewels and random stuff. Let's see what happens. All right. Ribbon. Some ribbon. Okay. Some shabby. He's saying he's seeing chic and no shabby. Hmm. <laughs> mine is pretty shabby. Just give it a second. <laughs> yeah. well, I keep pulling there. strings off, so mine's pretty shabby as well. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but you do you, you use sandpaper too, so that's that's shabby kind there of. There we right? go. <laughs> well, I'll bring the shabby. You guys bring the chic. <laughs> Deal. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know if I have much chic. <laughs> This is looking kind of rustic now, but I'm looking at it. <laughs> no, no, no. Yours is definitely shabby chic, I think, because I'll tell you why. I think because that paper you have is super chic. Yeah. Okay, good. 
Yeah, it is. Okay, I'm adding lace to the border Ooh, that'll make it of this thing. Cheap. Yeah, I'm. I'm just. We're working on it. Working on it. I might distress the inside paper. Not too sure. Let's see what happens. What time all day? Oh, my daughter did the same thing when she was younger on picture day. That's what I said. <laughs> oh, no. What did you do? Did you put a bow on it? That's what a crafter would do. Did you put oh, a yeah. bow on it? <laughs> Throw some on. ribbon on it. It makes everything better. <laughs> I agree. Oh, my gosh. Oh. Imagine. Oh, my gosh. Then it's forever <laughs> in that yearbook. <laughs> Welcome, Maddie. Welcome to the shenanigans. Hey, Maddie. Let me see. Maddie. For <laughs> okay. Now the comments are funny. Let's see. Let's see. Okay. If you guys can hear my children, I am sorry. They are awake. I can't hear them. <laughs> Where is my, where is my stuff? Where is my stuff? I want to distress it. I want to distress it. Yep. That's what's going to happen. Where is my blue stick? Uh-oh. Somebody opened the door. I'll be right back. <laughs> So I don't like this white paint on here. So I just wet my uh, paint brush to take some of it off mm. <laughs> in case anyone's wondering. <laughs> Rhonda says, yes, she doesn't want her picture. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh my goodness. All right. Gonna have to go to something else because my glue sticks are not here. Hot glue. I don't know where it went. Okay, moving on to the next thing. Distressing. Gonna use some antiquing wax by Folk Art Home Decor. As you can tell, I love this stuff. I'm just going to distress it with my favorite chippy brush from Dollar Tree. The kids brush from Dollar Tree. Oh my gosh, what happened to it? <laughs> what do you mean? <laughs> <laughs> nope, that's too much. Okay. Viewers, I'm deciding between the teacup the teacup or three roses. Mm. So let me know which one I should use because I'm stumped. The roses. Are where are so we putting pretty. it? Where Where are you putting it? I'm gonna put it probably like on this egg, like right here. Mm. I'm leaning towards roses. Me I kind too. Of too. But teacup would be super cute and fun. I don't the, know. The teacup has the colors that I've been using tonight, but. I think the rose definitely is the, like the shabby chic look. Mm, yeah, I think they're both. Yeah, <laughs> I don't know. Let's see. Okay. Oh, everyone says roses. Okie dokie. Roses. Yes. If then. The viewers have spoken. <laughs> so guys, if you can, I would so appreciate it if you check out their channels they are super duper creative and make beautiful DIYs. i'm not just saying that because they're my friends i'm dead serious they're amazing <laughs> thanks fabby <laughs> i'll send you that 50 dollars in a minute <laughs> as if <laughs> I, I joke i joke <laughs> Oh, I shabbied it up a lot. I don't know. Maybe I put too much. Oops. Sorry, guys. I try to dull it down a little bit. I don't know if you guys can see that, but it's a little dull. Can you see? I kind of 
distressed it. Do you see it? Oh, a lot. yeah. I try to darken it up a little bit. Just letting you guys know. Nice. Taking you step by step. All right. So what do you do when your glue stick runs out? Your glue gun runs out. What do you do? What do you guys do? It's a real question. <laughs> I get mad. <laughs> what do you do? Get another one. <laughs> well, let's say you're like, you, you have no more. Oh, uh, Mod Podge. Mod Podge. Or Tacky Glue. Do you have Tacky Glue? Yes. Tacky Glue, where are you? Uh, so one time uh, at band camp, no. One time, <laughs> one time I shoved um, a stick into here to try to, I hope you guys are watching what I'm talking about. <laughs> one time I shoved something in there to make the, the hot glue come out the other side. And I destroyed my glue gun. Don't oh, do that, guys. No. Don't oh, do my that. gosh. And my husband fixed it because he put a heat. Okay, so what happened was when I went like this, the hot glue went backwards. And it oh. kind of messed up the, the thing. So don't oh, do that, guys. No. Thanks, Bobby. Appreciate that. So, yeah. Don't be crazy like Fabby. It was the, the Gorilla Glue glue gun. But then my husband fixed it because guess what he did? This is why I keep him around. Because That's so nice to have handy <laughs> hubbies. Yes. So what he did was he used the heat gun and he melted the, the glue gun at the back of it. Oh, smart. And cleaned it up. Hmm. So there's a tip if you guys ever run into that conundrum. That is pretty brilliant, actually. <laughs> All right. So that's my shabby sheep egg so far. It looks a lot better in person. This camera's not giving it justice. <laughs> <laughs> it looks a lot better in person, I promise. <laughs> oh, goodness gracious. <laughs> ah, we only have 12 minutes left. I know. Okay. Okay. Let's do crackle really quick. If I don't do crackle today. I'll do crackle tomorrow. I promise. One second. <laughs> we will crackle. Yes, crackle on. I'm going to <laughs> crackle on, Garth. I think I just dated myself. That Wayne's world. Yeah. yeah. I think you might be on mute. Oh, gotcha. <laughs> <laughs> it's like, it's very quiet. She's like, exhibit A. <laughs> <laughs> that was on purpose. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so I just made three little lace bows using this Dollar Tree lace, and we're going to add it to our garland. I love that lace. It's so versatile, isn't it? it I use it all the time. Oh, yeah, totally. Now I have that song stuck in my head. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> All right. It is coming along. Crayons in a glue gun. Ooh, and squirt it into molds. Ooh, that's from Karina. That sounds kind of cool. Mm. I've never done crayons. Huh. I did get one of the um, Dollar Tree glue guns specifically for like 
different types of glues, you know, like those glitter glues that last forever mm -hmm. and you can't get them out of your glue gun. So I got a <laughs> tree glue gun for that. That might mm -hmm. be kind of cool to use cr the crayons in. Wow. I'm, I'm, I'm not, guys, I'm like mind blown. Yeah. I love that idea. Thanks so much for sharing that. I love that, Karina. Yeah, that's really cool. Oh, love that lace ribbon, Ellie. Oh. My Dollar Tree doesn't have any of these pretty rub-ons I keep seeing everyone use. Oh, I'm so sorry about oh. that, Betty. I wonder if they sell them online. I haven't looked, but I wonder if they sell that kind of stuff like in, like if you need to buy it in bulk or if you can have access like to it. Tree? Yeah. Yeah, they up the price. Like on Amazon, they sell them. A friend oh, of mine okay. bought a friend of mine bought a one dollar carrot for eight dollars on Amazon. <gasps> what? Oh, that's not cool. Yeah. I'm thinking copper. No, should I do copper? I want to do copper. Copper might be cool. Moxie, you like copper. I love copper. That's your color, you said, it in your is. house, right? Yeah, I use it a lot during the fall. Yeah. If you guys didn't see that video, you should check it out. She made some pretty cool pumpkin wall decor. Oh. oh. Where is it? Where is it? Oh, there's my gold. Sorry, guys. I couldn't find the gold. This is... I, I'm going to use this one. This is Auntie Gold by Hobart. It's a good one. It's a good one. I recommend this one. Oh, yeah. I like that one. Uh, oh, I love their metallics. They're so pretty. Yes, Antique Gold. So let me see if I can quickly do something over here. To show the crackle. Let's show the crackle. Oh, that was close. What did John do? Oh my gosh. Never mind. <laughs> Never mind. PSA hot glue is hot. <laughs> <laughs> oh my word. Are you okay? <laughs> I'm fine. <laughs> oh my gosh. Gosh. That's exactly what I need. Oh boy. It's okay. <laughs> I heard mustard work helps. What does? I think on day two, Crafty Peep was here, or great or day three. Don't quote me, guys. I'm sorry. Um, one of those days, it's all a blur. Um, one <laughs> of those days, Crafty Peep came on. You know, Crafty Peep. Uh huh. And she was saying, if you have a burn, to put mustard on it. Really? That it instantly takes away the pain. Huh. I'll have to remember yeah. that. That's cool. Doesn't it sound like it would be painful, though? I mean, mustard is pretty. I mean, because it's like a vinegar thing, right? That's true. Yeah. That's like a mustard seed. Yeah. Interesting. I would probably try it on myself before my kids. <laughs> <laughs> Here, put some mustard on it. <laughs> oh, poor children. <laughs> Does it burn? <laughs> it works. <laughs> Put a bow on it. <laughs> oh my goodness. Oh my gosh. <laughs> uh, you guys are you guys are funny. <laughs> okay, so my Easter egg has a cape. <laughs> I love it. What? Oh, <laughs> I'm oh, laughing right. because you're laughing. I think it's beautiful. Oh my god! I think it's laughing, but I think it's funny. <laughs> I just read John's comment. That's oh, why is I that it? It. Yeah. oh gosh, I don't even want to know. <laughs> oh. Okay, maybe I'll. Yeah. <laughs> All right, I'll share that with anyone watching if you guys want to laugh. Oh, lavender essential oil is awesome for burns, says Connie. Oh, my gosh. There we go. Oh, boy. The cape makes it shabby. 
Hey, Maddie says, super egg. <laughs> oh. <laughs> super egg. <laughs> so, I don't, I don't know what to do. I think I might do this. I don't know, but then it kind of looks like a headpiece. <laughs> it's like, <laughs> it's just royal. Going. And they the royal one, sell, like those little like um, costumes for eggs. <laughs> you might be starting a new thing. You don't even know. <laughs> you might be starting a new trend. We shall call her Royal Egg. <laughs> <laughs> Queen of the other egg. Your Royal Eggs. Let's see. Kind of reminds me of Downton Abbey. <laughs> yeah. Let me see. Are you serious, though, Moxie? <laughs> I love it. Are you going to do it for real? Yeah, I'll do it. Do it. You only live once. Let's see. Oh, good. oh my gosh. The, the, I hope the guys are behaving in the chat. Oh, my. Elizabeth the third. <laughs> That's awesome. <laughs> All right. So I'm going to put this first layer on. So I just put the old layer on. It doesn't have to be perfect because it's only going to peek through the top layer. So I'm going to mute it again and try to show you guys this before. Time's up. Oh, yeah. We only have three minutes. Let's see the crackle. No, oh, I can't wait. Egg Elizabeth. <laughs> <laughs> Isn't that awesome? <laughs> <laughs> All right, there she is. There's Eggs Elizabeth <laughs> <laughs> with her her super cape. <laughs> what is the last name in Downton Abbey? Grantham. <laughs> oh, yeah. Lady Grantham. Lady. <laughs> Lady. <laughs> <laughs> now I'm just waiting for mine to dry. <laughs> and then we're done. Oh, oh thank you, Maddie. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I think mine is pretty dry. Let's see if I can show you guys. This cute little garland, let me flip over the little bows. Let's see if they'll behave. Do you wanna make you big, okay? Oh, oh, I'm big. <laughs> it's kind of hard to show them. They look like this. Oh, I love that. They are if I, so If I was against a wall, maybe. That looks really pretty. They're beautiful. Yeah, I love Let that. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> I love that so much. I guess my shirt. <laughs> you could wear it oh, as a I necklace. That. <laughs> <laughs> That's great. And what's on the back? Oh, I just painted it brown just to match. I love it. That looks so good. See, it went a little bit more rustic than I thought. <laughs> Shabby chic is rustic sometimes. A little bit rustic. I love it so much. Okay, so I'm gonna try to put the medium on. Let's see. Let's turn it over so you guys can see it. I'm gonna put the medium on real quick. Let's see if I can get this done quick. Oh my goodness. It's seven o'clock. Oh, my computer told me it's seven o'clock. Yeah. So I'm just gonna oh I forgot. Look, before you use the crackle medium, you guys gotta like mix it well because it's not, you know, just like a paint. It's for it to work, you know, like all the molecules to mix and stuff. I'm not too scientific. I'm just saying. <laughs> Super cute, oh. Ellie. All the oh, comments are flooding in. Hold up. Hold up. <laughs> you got to know, Ellie. You got to know. So pretty, Ellie. Adorableness. Oh, oh cute, Aww. Ellie. Very pretty, Ellie. Beautiful, Ellie. Love your garland. Aw. So Thank you, guys. So nice. So pretty, Ellie. Oh, no, wait. There's more. So That's pretty, more. Ellie. <laughs> Those are gorgeous. That is so cute, Ellie. Great job, Ellie. 
It's nice to meet you all and craft. Oh, thanks, Rhonda. I appreciate that. Aww. Oh. All right, great job. All all beautiful. Yes. Aww. So I'm gonna put on the crackle medium really quick. It really happens really fast. So I'm gonna put it on. Let's hope it works today. So I can show these people. <laughs> Oh my gosh, this might be like an epic fail, guys. <laughs> oh man, I hope it works. Let's see. Okay. Crackle medium. All right, so now this layer has to dry. So I'm going to put it on there. Oh my gosh, you guys are all watching me. No pressure. <laughs> <laughs> Please, God, let it work. <laughs> Oh, Love all those fancy eggs. <laughs> Michelle, do you, Michelle, do you want to show your eggs one by one so we can sure, admire them? Oh. Beautiful, beautiful. Here she is. <laughs> <laughs> Oops. Oops. <laughs> Don't drop the lady her. herself. <laughs> this one I oh, dry brushed. I dry brushed with like a, an aqua color. Oh, that's pretty. And are those stickers? Yeah, th these are just stickers. Oh, I just hot glued cool. them on. And that's it. The other ones are still kind of drying slash need work <laughs> <laughs> is that it the egg that's show's it. over that's it that's the egg show. <laughs> all right guys i'm sorry i'm a disappointment today it's not drying okay oh it's kind of crackling i can kind of see it um no <laughs> um, no. <laughs> no okay so I'm going to finish this project tomorrow. Hopefully you guys can tune in. I'm so sorry. I don't want to disappoint you. I'm sorry. Okay, so <laughs> I'm going to put this in here and then add the greenery tomorrow. But that way the crackle finish can um, dry properly and actually impress you guys. Okay. <laughs> so that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to reveal the number because Maria told me twice that I forgot to give the number. And I'm so sorry, Maria. Please forgive me. Okay. So I'm going to go ahead and give the number now. The number today is? I hope you all guessed. Oh, my goodness. Did you guys all guess a number? I'm going to guess. Wait, can we guess? Let me see. I'm going to say. Everybody guess the number between 75 and 132. <laughs> and then. 112. Yes. But this is all I'm working <laughs> with. This is all I'm working with right now, guys. I'm sorry. And it's, it's, it is what it is. Okay. <laughs> I'll get there. <laughs> in crafting it takes time right yeah. so hopefully i give you guys enough time to write your number down in the chat box and the number is oh i was so close ellie almost got it <laughs> get out of my head ellie <laughs> did anybody I, guess i don't know oh, I gotta check. Let me so see. close oh um robin said to, from to mention the bridgerton um Oh, collaboration. Was, oh, that yeah. is coming out um, March 22nd at 1 p.m. Eastern. So if you're interested in joining us, I can add you to the chat. Or if you're interested in watching, keep an eye out for it. It's coming. It's going to be Bridgerton, light aesthetic um, look. And um, Bridgerton, the series, starts again on the 25th. So I can't wait. So light, light, like light academia. <laughs> and, yes. I, and, I, and I hope my project is good enough. For the Bridgerton Club, I'm sure so I'm will also going to be participating. I'm so excited, and I have a uh, collaboration also coming up on March 20th. It's the Christ is Risen collab, so it's going to be all about Jesus Christ. Yay. So yeah. I'm hoping to get into that. And then, um, Ellie, do you have anything coming up? Any collaborations or challenges um, you're participating in? Or hosting? Well, there's the Thrift Flip challenge tomorrow, and then Sunday there's Easter around the world, and then. Yes. Let me see. What else do we have? Hello, uh, hello, there's baby. So I, don't know. I know there's so much stuff. Another um, mystery box swap. 
Ooh, Ooh, so so much stuff. Right. So guys, don't forget to check out their channels, um, both Moxie DIY and Java and DIY from house to home. Um, they are, I'm telling you, they're incredible. I'm not even joking. So please check them out in the description box below. And I want to thank you ladies so much for coming on with my shenanigans and having fun crafting live with me. Thank you for having thank us. Thank you for having us. This is so <laughs> this much fun. fun. All right, guys, take care. God bless. See you tomorrow at 8 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Bye. <laughs> Bye, guys. Bye everyone. Ah, not ending. <laughs>